Mayor Harder has declared the area a disaster area. Line, this is control. I think we got sound. Put it back to work. We had a tornado roll through town last night. When I say through town, literally through in the middle. And it's uh, there's just devastation. So I actually got a call from our weekend anchor saying we need to call everybody in. This will be the definition of the big news day for many, <laughs> many years to come. This was huge for us. Appointments at the Founders Building and East Building. For us today, especially, iNews is the glue that held everything together. Nice job, real clean. We had reporters, producers, everybody called in. Um, and now today, it's pretty much, yeah, one of the biggest things that we've had to deal with in months. So we are scrambling as we did yesterday and last night and all day today, making sure that people have the information they need to stay safe. All right, so once again, they are just wrapping up their news conference today. Sarah. We're a small market, relatively small staff, uh, but we like to tell everybody we're very scrappy. Yeah. Yeah. Done. There's not a lot of us, but we do talk a lot. Anything you think you can tell me now that you think you could point out? She may have the latest information on, yeah, we have a confirmed tornado. Yeah. Green Bay Street. Yeah. I think it has more weight after you tell me how bad it was. The beautiful thing about the way we're doing it now is everything is shared so that everybody is able to see what everyone else is working on. That's what's great about iNews is it's all right there and it's really easy to use. And then we can just come back to a shot of Corey and, and then, then widen out to, yeah. yeah. iNews is the hub. I mean, iNews is the central operating system for our newsroom. Five seconds, standby two, standby to Miger. Miger. All board, serving, weather services. It's been really, really helpful to us just in terms of stacking a show, dropping stories in, taking stories out, floating stories if we need to. And we had to think on the fly and what can we get rid of, what maybe can we add, just fiddling around with everything today. Do you want me to just move, save the data up and kill the rest of the debug? It's great when you have a chance to react to a big event like that. Can we maybe roll some video? This is going on. News people love news, and, and we love to cover news. And the bigger the story, the better. And I think in this case, you, you really saw our crew rise to that challenge and exceed expectations on, on how to cover a story like this. In a small market news operation, as in any news market, it's all about speed. Um, being able to move content from the field into edit to on air as quickly as possible. The avid workflow just makes it so logical and simple to do. Everybody in that room, in this control room, is very conscious and of, of needing to work together, and that's not something you need to remind them of. It just happens. And I'm, I am always so amazed on days like this, what people are capable of, and it all comes together. <laughs>